I start formally, I have two questions for you. My first question is, do you like Cantonese food or dishes? My second question is, do you know any English word that originated from the Cantonese dialect? Today, I'm going to talk about something that related to the above mentioned two questions. First and foremost, I want to say something about the Cantonese food. Here's a saying in Chinese, 实在广东, which means Guangdong is a paradise for gourmet food. Especially, Guangdong is famous for yam cha. Do you know anything about yam cha? Let me introduce it. Yam cha, which literally means drinking morning tea, does not mean merely to drink a cup of tea. Actually, you will enjoy a lot of dim sum during the yam cha time. I strongly recommend you to have a choice of the shrimp dumpling. When you bite a little bit of the shrimp dumpling, you can feel a rich aroma of the fresh shrimp and the soy sours. The next remarkable dim sum is chicken feet with pickled peppers. Personally, I think the chicken feet slightly matches the pickled pepper very much. But if you're the person who cannot accept the chicken feet, you strongly recommend you to have a choice of the glutinous rice chickens. The juicy chicken meat stuffed in a glutinous rice, which is wrapped by a lot of leaf. Last but not least, drinking morning teas is also a marvelous way for you to learn about the Chinese culture. Also, enjoy the precious purity of human emotions. Actually, uh, probably, my introductions makes you hungry, right? But I'm sorry to say that I have to keep you here for a little while. And I'm going to introduce some English word that originated from the Cantonese dialect. Just now, I introduced dim sum and yam cha. These two words are English words which originated from the Cantonese dialect. Besides these two words, there are still lots of vocabularies that originated from the Cantonese dialect, such as bok choy, bai cai, wen tun, yun tun, kou tou, kou tou, qiong san, chang shan, sub gong, shi jin, gong hei fa choy, gong xi fa cai. All these above mentioned vocabularies have already accepted accept by English words and become an English word in dictionary. As a Chinese girl, I'm so proud of our Chinese culture. Food and language are only very small parts of our culture trees of the Chinese culture. And if you are also interested in our Chinese culture, you are warmly welcome to visit my country and city. And I'm very honored to be your gourmet guide. And I'm waiting for you in Guangdong, China. Thank you.